what's up guys and welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm still with one of the most powerful youtubers in kenya guys we are still together and today we are going to have a sit down so we'll have a sit down ask her a few questions if you have never heard anything about dimwango <laughs> take a look dimwango is here what's up guys <laughs> you see <laughs> well i really love his energy so hi guys hope you're doing fine my name is dimwango from kenya now here in lusaka don't forget <laughs> to subscribe before we forget guys yeah, please make go sure show me always some love. show some love Head with on. this powerful young lady yeah my youtube channel is just here he'll just put it here. here please go subscribe show me some love and i will really really appreciate it. and also if you're from team d and you're watching this show him some love you know thank you yeah so we're coming live from lusaka actually yeah sure okay i think guys this one let's just talk a little bit a little bit i want us to know a little bit about jim wango i know quite a bit <laughs> I don't even do know that there are some questions I can never even ask her because I know her quite sure. quite a bit. Like but if for your sake, Chav Entertainment knows what I eat, what I love more. He knows my religion. He knows <laughs> the siblings, your yeah, father, everything. your mother. Everybody. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So okay, who is Jim Wango really? For the sake of me, a yeah. little bit, but our audience as usual. So guys, Dean Wango is a proud village girl born and bred back in Kenya, okay? That's where I belong. I'm a Kenyan by birth, by everything, by blood. I love my country, Kenya. And um, I'm just a passionate content creator. So I travel country per country, okay? Creating content, showing people what they expect. If by chance they happen to go to those countries, I always try to show them what it means like staying in that country and what to expect. I think that's the simplest way. That's I the simplest way. Okay, now myself. there is one and thing. I'm a solo traveler. I travel you see, alone. she's a solo traveler, a very strong lady, and I can attest to that. Now, ladies and gentlemen, what I want you to like here, I want to ask you, Dimwango is that Dimwango is a so is a go oriented person. Dimwango is a go getter. She doesn't like wish things to come anyhow. She goes to go and get whatever she. Where do you get that kind of courage, D? Because many ladies are not like you. Okay, number one, I know. Like my mother bred me, and she will always tell me. Okay, before I started content creation, when I was a student, she always told me, my daughter, make sure you work hard so that in the near future you can have something in your handbag. Okay, mm. that alone kept me motivated all wow. along since when I was a younger. So I grew knowing as a woman, if you don't have what you call yours, if you don't have what you love, where you can dedicate your time, then you, you know, you are just messed up as a woman. So every day, like where I get the energy is the fact that I know nobody will do it for wow. me. I know there's no man mm -hmm. who will wake up and travel on my behalf and create mm -hmm. videos and post them on my channel. Okay, so I'm like, I have to do this. And if I don't do it, nobody else will do it for me. That's yeah. where I get my motivation. Wow, that's where your motivation one. comes from. Yeah. And then the other thing, let me talk about it. I have a lot of female friends, mm -hmm. both in the YouTube space mm -hmm. and also just in the ordinary, normal life. Mm -hmm. Now, this friend, you find that he, the, your energy, yes, I saw it in the previous videos. Now, I proved it. We've been together now. It's uh, not just today. Yeah. Yesterday, we were together. They tried to spend almost sure. the whole day. And yeah. today, we are almost spending the whole day together. Yeah. What I've noticed, you have some unusual energy again, <laughs> apart from being unusual energy. Thank yesterday, you. we walked and walked kilometers. I was even worried at one time. <laughs> I would observe to say maybe at this moment She's she, tired. Would, she would say let's slow down but we kept on going until sunset until it was late we had to go and start preparing i mean for uploads and so forth to videos to create again where does your strength come from because few ladies have got that kind of strength many ladies would want cheap life easy and then you also go the other way for example, we went into the deepest of the deepest, Soweto is an area where ladies like your type, don't go. they don't go there, they can't go and waste, they would rather buy expensive stuff mm -hmm. elsewhere but not to enter Soweto market. Maybe that one as well. 
Okay, another thing is, la, is that uh, guys, for those who don't know, Kenya is in Africa. I'm a typical African girl. To make it worse, like I've been bred in the village. So mm. where I grew really trained me for this in one way or the other that I might not know. Because mm -hmm. when I used to be a small girl, I used to go to the farm, get sweet potatoes, I have to go cook for family, mm. go collect firewood, I have to come cook for family. Clean water, I've seen you carrying all. water on your yeah, head. So <laughs> I think like being an ascetic on the road is something that that is in me um, and also i feel naturally okay i feel naturally i'm a hard worker like i don't really complain like i don't like saying ah, ah no 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 so i think that's naturally in me good okay again naturally also the background of the village and so yeah. forth i've had the, I've, I've, i share a little bit of that as well yeah. but uh now let's take it now to youtube content creation now that is where the real story comes if you are a youtuber listen opening Listen your ears very well. YouTube, now D, your channel is one of the fastest growing YouTube channels I've ever seen in Africa. And I mean <laughs> Africa. If you. I say Kenya, maybe I only know two people mm -hmm. who have got similar to your space. If I, if I use, the, of course, Kenya as an example, yes. like I said, I know more than 20 YouTubers in yes. Kenya. I would relate you, you are the second, you and Mungai Eve are those who really make it happen. What has been your secret to move your channel so fast? There were people, for example, no, I'll give you, an, I will not give examples for the sake of people so that they do, I don't increase unnecessary haters here. Yeah, sure. Mm, I saw people when you were starting, your, there was a time, because when you started YouTube, I already knew Marwa. I was already subscribed mm -hmm. to Marwa's channel. Mm -hmm. You were around one between one thousand and three thousand subscribers. Mm -hmm. There were some subscribers who were ahead of you. Yeah. Maybe they were already at three thousand. Content creators. Mm -hmm. Content creators were already at the, around three thousand. Mm -hmm. You came in. Those were around three thousand. You bypassed them. Some are still around five thousand. Mm -hmm. Some have not even reached five thousand. But you went received during the silver button you are now more than 125,000 subscribers wow that is big well, again you come back to the same thing of course i have got an idea but i don't want to be the one to to, yeah. to talk about for example to say yes i know you work hard i know some of them but what has really made you and you have a lot of videos again you see, why were you answering all those people should also factor in? You have more than 400 videos on your yes. channel. So, again, what has been the secret? Why is it that your channel has been growing so fast? Okay, number one, it's because the, the moment I discovered YouTube, I realized there's future there. Mm -hmm. So I always told myself, this is what I want to do. Even after completion of my degree, this is what I'll do. Mm -hmm. Even when I was a student, I could still do it, knowing this is what mm -hmm. I'll survive on after studies. Mm -hmm. So guys, what I'd like to say is, people say there's no time, but there's always time for what you cherish. <laughs> there's always time for what you love in this world. What mm -hmm. you have is always great time, and you'll never have experience. Mm -hmm. So number one, what makes me really work hard on that YouTube space is the fact that I know that's where like that's where I'm comfortable, you wow. know. And uh, the fact that okay, I already started by saying I was raised in the village. So uh, you know, even went to the capital city like not even more than five years ago. Yeah, that's yeah. when I stepped in the mm -hmm. capital city. Mm -hmm. So since YouTube now can help me like cross mm -hmm. borders, wow. I'm like, oh my goodness, like I, I count myself as super blessed by God. Mm -hmm. And again, when God you know, when you work hard, God blesses the work of your hands, okay. you know, but when you are lazy, you know, that's why I have over 400 videos. Video? Now yes, that's a hard way. Like, every day I upload videos, and what I want to say is, it's not easy Ooh. going on the streets because I'm my own editor, yeah. I'm my own camera, camera lady, pencil. I do yes. everything for myself, I plan everything You have to plan your myself. videos. So, it's, it's just, I can say passion is also part of it, because something which you don't love, you can't wake up in the morning and go and do it. Mm, you understand? Mm, 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 and the fact mm. that I know that's all that I cherish, that's all that I'm doing, just the way we have doctors watching, we, yeah. have, we have politicians, we have all those people. Me too, it's my career by myself. Yeah, yeah, so, I have yeah. to give it my Your best. Worst. You know, I have to motivate myself. You know what, D, you are a winner. Let's keep doing this. You know, wow. we can do this. You know, this is not the end. You know, where we are is at, at least better than where we come from. So there's no need to 
to lose hope or give up on anything. So I'm always my number one cheerleader, my number one motivator. And I always tell myself I was born to win. Okay. Anyway, and being a winner, it doesn't just happen overnight. Success mm -hmm. doesn't just happen overnight. Doesn't you don't wake fall. up in the morning and you're ready for success. Come you know, on, just you wishing. Have, yeah, you have to struggle. <laughs> you know, you have to struggle. Uh -huh. yeah? Because it is following the next question, as we end, we wrap up this video. The, the final thing I wanted to ask, like mm -hmm. as we go towards the end, there is mm -hmm. one thing, maybe yeah. that one is also for me. I've had my own share, people think that uh, I've grown a little bit faster because I've also taken a lot, overtaken a lot of people, but I feel I can do better than what I'm but doing. But again, never be like, I want to overtake people. Guys, mm -hmm. always be your have own. Have your own. own yeah, every day, always move ask at yourself, your own pace. Am I better than who I was yesterday? Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. what I always ask. So yourself. you compete with Even yourself. If others don't see my growth or anything, but I'm like, you know what? Mm -hmm. I'm better than what I was yesterday. Yes. At least I'm working hard every day. So that keeps me motivated. No competition with any. Of course, you can watch other people and be like, hey, I wish to get, get to inspiration, this level. Yes, yeah, get like inspiration, yes. Get inspired, but, but not competition. If you compete with other people, like you'll be depressed. Yes. And you'll give up in what wow, you do. Wow, so wow. you have to just ask yourself, you know. And success is something that happens gradually. Gradually. Like it's step by step. Like it matures. Step by, you don't just wake up, you know. Like the best success is what comes like step by step gradually. You don't just wake up and you're already successful because you won't know where you came from. You won't cherish where you've been. So it's you always gradual appreciate. and you have to accept the process. And always be on you know, be your own competitor. Always ask yourself, Am I better than who I was yesterday? Chase your dreams. It's you who know what to do. You don't have to explain okay, to everybody. To, to avoid this yeah? video being too long, uh, guys, what I want is I want to ask Dim Wango one thing maybe this yeah. one is also for me uh -huh. and many content creators a lot of content creators mm -hmm. on this channel how can you what advice do you have for one there are youtubers who are like stagnant mm -hmm. as much as we don't compete there are content creators who are like they have been on one level for a long time mm -hmm. or people who are not yet maybe at 1000 subscribers they have been pushing even today I've had some questions, some people are asking me, how come you came from behind, you are already now, monetized, and I'm not just monetized, I've like gone beyond 15,000. Now there are some people who are still struggling. What do you think <laughs> is See, a I missing that, name? Wait, I love that word, struggling. Uh -huh. Struggling is, is good. It's good. Eh? <laughs> now here's a situation where somebody has been below 1,000 for more than two years. Okay, the reason is... Why more than know? two years. Mm -hmm. What do you think would be the reason? Is it that YouTube hates them? YouTube doesn't hate anyone. <laughs> and the secret is, guys, the more you work hard, the more you achieve the success mm -hmm. and that's what my elder brother Maro used to tell me the more you are the more videos you upload the more success you just know repeat that, that sentence again the more videos you are we upload, right the way here. the more videos you upload mm -hmm. the more you become successful the lesser videos you upload the lesser you grow mm -hmm. so you can imagine and also it means creating videos is not that easy so mm -hmm. imagine you're creating videos every day every day you are putting in effort mm -hmm. so what i'm trying to say you have to work for it there's no way, I'm pretty sure, there's no way you can upload videos every day and to take you two years to get 10,000 subscribers. Now we Guys, if you've been mm -hmm. uploading videos every single day and you haven't hit it, a hand a 1000 subscribers in one year please just let me know just, just let me know you'll find mm -hmm. that people are not yet there they don't really want. there's something else that they value more than content creation okay? there are people who do one video per month now that one will even stay there for like 20 years once Honestly, and maybe two videos in a month because uh -huh. you know like the way you create the more you increase your chances of maybe one of your videos will go viral but now if you're not creating what will go viral their chances are not there yeah. thank you so much yeah so wow the secret is the more you upload the more successful you become the lesser everything goes down Guys, I almost can't let this lady go, but looking at time, I don't want this video to be more than uh, more than 15 minutes. Thank you so much, D, talking to you. I think I'll come back with one more video yeah. uh, with D, otherwise I appreciate her so much. Uh, I appreciate you so much for Thank coming you. to that. You've been a great inspiration for, Thank you, for sure, boys. even to myself. Thank I really am really, really very grateful. Nice. Boom. Thank, Thank you guys. You. Please close, say bye to our people and subscribe. Guys, so go check me out. D Mango on YouTube.
consider subscribing, join the squad, and also if you're from Team D, you know how we do it. Go show him some love and tell him D Mongo sent you to his channel. And we wanna see you soon on our next video. Bye. Bye. bye.